Imagine being the proud sole owner of a beautiful narration of the Madhushala by none other than the legendary Amitabh Bachchan or some of the most iconic posters depicting the mega star's life. All you need to do is log into a website, buy the digital property and be the sole owner. <laughs> Imagine owning a custom version of this famous recitation, a son's tribute to his father. Amita Bachchan has joined the blockchain revolution by launching his own NFTs or non-fungible tokens for his recital of poems from Madhushala. <laughs> Also on sale via NFTs are personally signed posters depicting the various landmarks in his cinematic career. All you need to do is access the website, register yourself and bid when the auction begins. The digital property will be yours. The ownership can be changed as and when you want. NFTs or non-fungible tokens are a phenomena that have taken the digital world by storm. Believe it or not, a 12-year-old in London has made nearly 3 crore rupees by actually creating digital images of whales and selling them as NFTs. Now, what NFTs essentially do is that they create a unique identity for a digital object and that ensures that the usage rights stay with the owner of that object. Now, using NFTs, you can verify the ownership and the authenticity of that particular object. This makes it an invaluable tool for high-ticket investors. The market for NFTs was just $80 million in 2019. It tripled to more than $250 million last year. And in the first six months of this year alone, NFTs worth $2.5 billion have been sold. Big B is not the only one to have jumped onto the NFT bandwagon. Celebrities like socialite Paris Hilton, actress Lindsay Lohan, singer Snoop Dogg, talk show host Ellen DeGeneres, skateboarder Tony Hawk, musicians Shawn Mendes and Eminem, and Twitter founder Jack Dorsey are among the early adopters of NFTs.